Hi everybody, it's me again with another bridge video. This time I'm going to talk about something that's been that's been mentioned a few times by a few people down on the Wednesday group, and that's frozen suits. Now, I would guess that some of you have never come across what's called frozen suits, but really you do need to understand what these things are. You may have come across on the score sheets um, when you open them up to put your score in. You may have seen that someone's got an extra trick or maybe you have not made the tricks that someone else has made. This could well be down to someone's led a frozen suit. So we need to understand what these things are so we can avoid actually leading them out so let's go and have a look at some cards and i'll try and explain what frozen suits are all about so what is a frozen suit well a frozen suit is deemed to be frozen when it has an honor in each of the hands so when dummy goes down each player is able to see cards in dummy and their own cards and if the pattern seems to be that you can see that you have an honor yourself in your hand a king in hearts in this particular case and you can see there's a queen in dummy then this suit is likely to be frozen you don't know where the other two honors are they could be in one hand but if they're split then certainly this suit is frozen and should not be led if you lead from this particular suit and it's frozen then you are likely to lose an extra trick let's see what the full hand looks like so this is the full hand in hearts so as you can see there's an honor in each of the hands here now frozen suits tend to be more prevalent in no trump contracts where the distribution of cards is likely to be quite balanced um, but they can occur of course in suit contracts as well so you need to be aware of that too so whoever leads from this particular hand will lose an extra trick so let's demonstrate now by leading from either hand or either side to see how many tricks they actually get so let's see what happens when South actually leads this particular suit. They lead the four towards the queen. West would duck, being second hand. Queen goes up and East would take with the ace. So East would probably play the 10 next south would likely cover with the jack it doesn't matter really if they put the eight or the jack on west would definitely put the king on the jack if the eight was put up then the nine would would go up and north would play low of course the five so that's another trick to east west west now plays the nine that trick is taken and of course west has the six of hearts which is a master that would likely be a fourth trick so in that particular instance where self led then east west made four tricks so let's see what happens when east west leads so west leads the three the five goes up from north east puts the ace on
and self plays low. So that's one trick to east west. So east now plays the 10. There's no need for self to put the jack on because it's covered by the queen in dummy. So self plays the eight. Obviously West will now play the king and low from north. So that's a trick now for east-west or another trick for east-west. Now the nine from west, the queen goes up, two from east, south puts the jack on. Now that's a trick to north-south. The six from west here is again likely to make a trick but can you see that in this particular instance north south has made one trick so that really demonstrates that an extra trick can be made and it does depend on where these honor cards are of course but it's likely to be an extra trick to the side that hasn't led the suit. So if you have led the suit, then you're likely to lose a trick. So in defense of all of this, you need to really try to encourage your opponents to lead this particular suit. And that can be difficult and um, or problematical because towards the end of play, depending on who's got the lead, they may be forced to lead this suit anyway. So you may be forced to, to lead it anyway. So yes, that's what frozen suits are all about. I hope that's useful to you because it will help your play and it will help with understanding where extra tricks might be made from. Okay, that's enough from me. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.